Hey everybody, I'm Jake, the Geek Out Tech, and today I'm going to talk a little bit more about editing in ScreenFlow 4, moving and adjusting clips. Now moving clips around in your timeline is pretty simple. All you have to do is click on the clip and just drag it to wherever you want. Just note that when you drag a clip over the top of another clip, it's automatically going to create a transition where those two clips overlap. i am put it back here. Now the other thing is adjusting clips. There's kind of two different ways to look at this. If you're like me and you're taking a lot of video out of your project, I tend to repeat my lines till I get it just right, so I need to remove a lot of video. So one method is to say I want to delete this section right in front of the scrubber. You can just split those clips, highlight the two, you can hit delete, click on the gap, hit the shift button, hold it down, click on the next gap for, for selecting both of them, and hit delete and close that gap. Now I like to use a different method, and with this next method, all you have to do is go over here to the edge of the clip. When you see this symbol, you can click and drag the edge of that clip to the scrubber. Now it's going to snap to that scrubber if up here in the view menu you have snapping selected. And I can do this with the bottom clip. Just click and drag and that adjusts that and then you can delete the gap after that. You can also close that gap with the scrubber but that doesn't seem to snap too well for me so I don't like using that method. I like using the highlighting the gap and deleting the gap. The same thing works for the end of the clips. Let me back up here. Let's say I wanted to delete this section after the scrubber. Same thing. When you see this symbol, just click and drag. So this method of adjusting clips by dragging the edges also works with things like images, text, annotations, things like that that you can add to your project. For example, let me add some text here real quick. So there's the text. If I go over to the edge, you see that symbol again, and you can click and drag it out. And what this controls is how long that text is going to appear in the video. So that's moving and adjusting clips. I'm Jake, the Geek Out Tech. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. It's the easiest way to support the channel. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time.